What's good, everybody? What's good, YouTube? I'm Jack, and this is Jack Reacts. And for today's reaction, y'all, we got Tank. Maybe I deserve. Big shout out to C Rob for the request on this one. I appreciate the love and support as per usual. And listen, man, if you're watching and there's a song or live performance you want me to check out, make sure to click that link down below. Send me your song, and I'll react to it and shout you out in the video, man. Um, listen, this is an incredibly popular song. I actually, now, I've definitely heard of Tank. I'm trying to think off the top of my head, have I reacted to Tank? I have to think I have, but I don't, if I have, it's probably been like maybe once or twice. Uh, but I definitely know that he can sing. I know he's a singer. Like I said, I've definitely heard of him before. We just haven't done that much of him on the channel, which is a shame. Um, and again, very popular song. So let's get straight into it, man. No music video this time. So damn late <laughs> for you to say I'm tripping. Just a homie from upstate. You said it's just a homie. Don't he know? It's one o'clock in the morning. You say it's cool, baby. It's cool. Maybe I deserve. Oh, I like that right there. He's coming into town. Later on this evening. And he was just wondering if you and him could hang out. Whoa. I don't like it. No, I gotta trust you. Mm. What? Hold on. <laughs> if, is he saying what I'm thinking? Of, he's saying he's talking about his girl, a guy's coming into town, like a guy best friend or some shit, and he don't like it, but he's gotta trust it. Yeah, absolutely not. That shit's getting shut down immediately. Immediately, Tank. Come on now. You're better than that. It says maybe I deserve. Yeah, maybe you deserve what you get. With a dumb decision like that. Tank. Come on, man. <laughs> hey, this sounds fire, though. I love he, he he has that, like, very classic 90s. This sounds like maybe late 90s, possibly early 2000s um, R&B right here. It's got that slow jam vibe on some, like, Tyrese, Genuine. You know what I mean? That's the the, the, the energy I'm getting right here. Just the, the great production, though. And, uh, and definitely a talented vocalist. I'm, I'm listening to the lyrics, though. What's about to go on? It ain't cool. Cause I know it's true Maybe I deserve For you to go out and find some other guy Maybe I deserve What? For you to stay out with them all night Maybe I deserve <sighs> For you to do all the things I did to you Maybe I oh, deserve Oh, oh Oh, yeah Maybe I deserve oh, Okay, so he, he ain't shit Never mind <laughs> What? Hold on Completely changed my whole opinion Yeah, maybe you do Maybe you do that's on you, big fella. Shouldn't have did that. Oh, yeah. Shouldn't have did that. For you to go out and find some other guy. I deserve for you to stay out with them all night. I deserve for you to do all the things I did to you. Yo, these are some real ass lyrics, bro. Now, again, he's not shit because clearly he was the grimy one first. So, of course, he should feel, you know, be feeling that stress. But, um, hey, man, yeah, that's some real stuff right there. <laughs> he said, take a drink to try to deal with this shit because I'm too stressed out. <laughs> I want to be oh, mad man. after all those times. For you to go out and find some other guy. Mm-hmm. 
You know what this reminds me of? I just reacted to not too long ago. Uh, if I were a boy, Beyonce. And it reminds me of, like, this to me is like the perspective of the guy in that song. Like, that song's about she's got this, like, grimy boyfriend who maybe doesn't full on cheat, but, like, doesn't care, flirts with his, you know, female co workers, doesn't put her first, et cetera, et cetera. Um, and it's from Beyonce's perspective of having to deal with that. So from my perspective, like I feel like I, I would like you could play these back to back, and this would be like his perspective from like he's the grimy boyfriend, then now he's projecting because he cheats and he you know does some you know grimy shit. He's projecting that onto his girl. You know what I mean? Damn. Damn. Yeah, well, you know, this was this was actually really good. This was very enjoyable. This had me captivated the whole time through. And again, y'all know that I'm a production person over a lyrics person. So for me to be captivated the whole time for lyrics definitely says a lot. This was very well written. Like, yeah, it's, you know, grimy. It's written from a grimy perspective, but very well written, bro. These lyrics were dope. I love like the storytelling aspect. I also love how it escalated throughout the song. Like by the end, he's like full on singing, man. Like, you know, maybe you should just go out and cheat on. Like, like <laughs> it went from like, you know, maybe I deserve to, you know, you don't pick up the phone. And then it's like, maybe you should go out and cheat on me and just tell me you did it. Go ahead and tell me. It's because he's so guilty with himself. It's that classic projection of like, you would almost rather them just cheat on you too so you can feel like we're even and i don't feel like the you know terrible evil person that i am shout out to tank man this was dope and thank you so much again to see rob for the request on this i appreciate the love and support i'm killing it with these requests all y'all have man uh, speaking of which if you would like me to react to a song of your choice click that link down below send me your song i'll react to it and shout you out in the video man um, but let me know what you thought about um, this song. I, I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all are going to be familiar with this. But um, regardless, give me your thoughts. Give me some more context. I feel like this is going to be a fun one to, to read the comment section on. Uh, listen, man, y'all have a blessed day, though. Blessed night and peace.